welcome back. Escape route here. Let's play as Knuckles, apparently. In the last few videos, we've tackled Ice Cap and Launch Base. Now we get to experience Mushroom Hill Zone and the start of the Sonic and Knuckles stages. And the levels I know. Now this brings back memories. The Hyper Ring. Can I even be bothered? This is where the stage begins for Knuckles normally. It's good to be back. I'm not so scared of dying from things I don't know are coming now, because... I know this. I hate those. <laughs> I wonder if they'll be in the 3DS version of this level. Probably. I've been trying to see as little material for Sonic Generations as possible, because every time I see material of that game, I want it even more than I already did before. Okay, managed to screw that one up. There'll be a spring here. Now I should get a checkpoint soon. I think it's across here. Oh yeah. How's that supposed to work? Supposed to have a checkpoint soon. There we go. Bonus stage time. Ah, oh, yes! And from the music is the one I'm good at. Okay, it looks like I'm avoiding that. For some reason, I messed up somehow. Recover some of those lives I lost on that boss. That shit was cool. More lives. Not bad. Well, looks like I'm set. I don't have a fire shield, unfortunately, so... I'm not really ready for this boss yet, but I may find one before the boss. A fire shield makes the bosses of Mushroom Hill Zone a walkover. You see, you'll have a few levels where the bosses are fairly easy. Because Sonic and Knuckles, of course, is designed, although it's chopped up from Sonic 3, it's designed to be a different game, and therefore, the first few levels are easy to claw you in. If you have a fire shield, you can jump underneath this guy and just keep pinning him. Anyway, he chops logs, and it's hard to tell whether he's going to chop them um, and they bounce, or chop them and they go to the right. This one will probably bounce. There's no way to know. Oh yeah, that's his head. But he's dead, so he can't use it. Ah, dead and head rhyme. Come on, spawn a monitor or something. Uh, I wish I knew how that worked. Cause there is a way to do it, but I don't know. How unfortunate. Well, 
this level is already different to Sonic's because Knuckles would have been there pressing the switch and making Sonic fly into the air, which he doesn't need in this version. And why am I bouncing like an idiot? The palette swap. It's another one of those glidey bits I don't like. Right, you don't let me bounce up there, but you let me go up there. How does that even make any sense? Then again, how does a place full of mushrooms even make any sense? Unless you're talking about Uncle Bob's garage where he keeps all good shit, am I right? Nah, I'm kidding. I don't know an Uncle Bob. And I don't even know what good shit's meant to be. I thought there might be a special stage ring to go gawk at and not actually go into, but there isn't. I was wrong about that. Ideally, I'd have crossed that with a few rings so I could start stop piling lives again, because Sandopolis is going to be an absolute curse. Oh shit, looks like I've gone in the special stage. Well, I might as well show you that I'm not skipping the special stages because I'm scared of them or anything. I am good at them, and I can do them all pretty easily, it's just... I don't feel like doing it on this run. But anyway, I'm coming here just for some rings, I think. You know, continue would be nice. Some points so I can get some more lives. It's the only reason I'm doing this. Also, I actually intend to do a Let's Play of Sonic 1 and Knuckles. So there's no point in, um, playing the stage now, really. Sonic 1 and Knuckles has, like, 10,000 of these bonus stages in it. It's basically these bonus stages over and over again, in case you didn't know what Sonic 1 and Knuckles is. You can also get it using the Sonic Mega, um, not Sonic Mega, Sonic, um, Sonic compilation cartridge for the Genesis will actually, um, allow you to play Sonic 1 and Knuckles. Ideally, they'd have changed the ROM header to Sonic 2 instead, and allowed you to play as, play as Knuckles in Sonic 2, but they didn't think about that. There we go. That sounds like a life to me. And there's a continue as well. Well, there we go then. There was a benefit to this. Oop. I appear to have messages on Facebook. It would be unprofessional to check them now. I can't tell who it is, because lots of my friends have the same name. <laughs> So from a glance, I can't tell you who it is. Aww. I'll check it at the end of this zone. There we go, I managed to avoid going in that one. Let me come up here. Woo, rings. Um special stage off to the right behind this chicken, but there's something cool I want to show you. I'll show you in a second when I come back, because I'm really scared that might be an important Facebook message I'm missing. Two seconds. Okay, I'm back. Basically, I was sent a um, video of of a Goemon game for the pachinko machines in Japan, for like the slot machines and stuff like that. It looks really, really awesome, but it just makes me very upset that Konami is still not actually doing anything with Goemon license. Whoa, secret area! And that's why I kept switching around down there. I don't know if that's how you get to there, but it's the only way I've ever done it. Whoa! Yes! Maybe an opportunity for some extra, extra lives before going to the boss battle? I hope I haven't lost my fire shield, because I've done this. 
fire shield is what makes this boss so easy. If I've given up on fire shield for four extra lives, then that's okay. Oh yeah, I was going to tell you about the thing that happens here with these um these red circles. I'm trying to do it. There's a frame where um where they flicker. That happens. Nah, looks like I can't get it to work. Seriously, I swear those little circles are flickering when we hit them for all of a split second. Nah, can't get it to work. I swear I'm right about that. I would bet 25 pence on me being right. So actually, I'm not that sure. This is a life. Emulator one side, Facebook the other. Look, just the extra rings I need to tip this over to a hundred, come on. I sure hope I come out of this with my fire shield. Yes! You are a nice game. And I couldn't get the one ring I needed for an extra life. Oh well. Bash here, then land. You automatically do this many hits to the boss. They all count. So now we should only have to do like two more hits to the boss. Okay, maybe not two. One more. Yeah. Here we go. The boss only took three hits, because we hit him right at the start. Well, the next zone is Flying Battery Zone, and whew, straight away that sort of Sonic & Knuckles difficulty is going to come straight back in that zone. There are some nasty bits, and then when it goes to Sandopolis, that's it, the game's back up to where it used to be, so... Ten lives, Flying Battery Zone, and... Let's end Mushroom Hill Zone. Knuckles got through Act 2 of Mushroom Hill Zone and didn't break a sweat. Until next time, if we live that long.